this is an electric car. Now, don't be afraid, it's not going to ruin your weekend. In fact, it'll probably make it better. They are clean, they are fun to drive, they're quiet, they don't make noise like those. The main problem is that they're a little bit expensive. This is, the, this is an MG electric vehicle. It's newly released in Australia. It is the cheapest new electric vehicle you can buy in Australia, but it's still going to cost you $44,000 on road, and that's just too much for most people's budgets. There's a big debate in Australia right now about whether we should be encouraging electric vehicles and whether we should be doing more to bring down the price of these new cars. Everybody else in the world is doing exactly that and the change to electric is happening really quickly. In Australia, they're resisting and one of the impacts of that is that all the big car makers or some of the big car makers are not bringing their electric vehicles to Australia. In Europe right now, you can buy you can choose between 175 different electric cars and some of them are as cheap as $20,000 and that makes it affordable for everyone. But the bigger question is this, are they cleaner than your petrol or diesel car? And the answer is yes. Some new research from the University of Queensland came out this week which makes it very clear. Even in Australia's grid back in 2018, dominated by coal, Cars such as this, electric cars such as this, will reduce emissions by up to 40% from your petrol and diesel cars. If we go to a renewables grid, say 80% or 90% as predicted and managed by the Australian Energy Market Operator, then the reductions of emissions from these electric cars will be 80%. And even if in a bizarre, bizarre setup where we had 100% coal, these things would still be cleaner. Why? Well, we keep on forgetting to calculate the emissions from making petrol cars and from refining their petrol, refining them, their oil and delivering them. If we burn fuel, we're going to be burning fuel imported from overseas. If we use electricity, we're going to be using mostly wind and solar made in Australia. That seems to me like a really good deal. Let's just hope we can get more cars like this and at half the price and we'll see a completely different community and less noise on the roads like that.